Welcome to the final episode of Fail Seal Arbiter's Mark, guys. Hopefully you've been having fun as we've kind of played through this game. Um, I know last episode you, we saw one ending. This episode we're actually going to see the good ending. Um, plus I'm going to give some thoughts on the game and show some of the other couple of cool things that or actually there's really one cool thing that I didn't use that you can use to like min max characters and whatnot um, so yeah let's uh, let's get into this and let's see this all right so for the secret ending which I totally missed uh, don't be like me <laughs> it's not secret ending the better ending um, you need to unlock uh, a particular class for one of the other people um, and he has to be here. Oh, and I don't know if I have the proper class. Um, so it's, it's Katara Gorge. Defeat all foes. You need to, um, get an item from him. Uh, you need to collect pelt. And because it drops a tarnished locket component. And... I don't know if I have anybody that has collect pelts. Um, scoundrel, no, it's Ranger. Ranger, let's see if he has collect pelt. Um, And I'll begin. I don't know if I even need to do that right now. Is that the same cadaver? Yes. A ranger. And I totally... All right. So we got the locket. What now? Now we go to camp. And our troop menu. And we craft a item. So we've got the tarnished locket here. Oh, actually... Craft an ancient locket. And then there should be a tavern that we go to. Go to a cantina. Go here. And there's a cutscene. Gossip, your turn. Dandy gossip. Oh, I hear all kinds of rumors. I'm sure I know something you'll find of interest. Listen to this. Decades ago, a young woman stood on the stoop of her family home, seeing her beloved off to battle. She grasped her locket against her breast, a symbol of their devotion. It was an exact match for the piece hanging around her beloved's neck. Drawing a ragged breath of icy air, she bid him farewell. Faithfully, she awaited his return. Long days of waiting turned into months, months grew into a year, and finally, several lonely years passed, but he did not return. After all this time, a letter arrived, explaining that though her beloved had fought valiantly, he had fallen in combat. However, faithful and patient she had been, he would never return. The woman fell into a deep despair. She spent her days alone, sitting in darkness. Their old home made a prison by her loss. But one evening, after the gloom had d displaced the sun, she heard a voice. It was her lover's voice, calling to her from the locket and bidding her to join him. Mesmerized by the voice and wanting nothing more than to be reunited with her beloved, she grasped the locket to her breast again and set out into the night to find him. What? What happened after that? Says the gossip. <laughs> Dandy gossip. The neighbors claimed she vanished and was never seen again. But the following year, folk began to talk of a ghostly woman who roamed the nearby woods, endlessly searching for a man wearing a matching locket.
All right. Now, we need to equip said lockets. Anybody? Not abilities, equipment. And there's going to be a boss. Ancient locket. Soft whispers coming from it. And then you go to Alpine Woods and fight a boss. Ooh, ghostly woman. Rena, I can't believe it. She She's real. That sketchy rumor you overheard must have been true after all. I don't think she's happy. Though, locket or no locket, she doesn't seem thrilled to see us. Alpine Woods. Objective, defeat all foes. Victory! Soul Eater. Radiant Serum. Diamond Thread. And the achievement laid to rest. And there's an event. Rainer. Mm -hmm. I've really outdone myself this time. Silky, velvety broth. The chicken is tender and moist. And the lemony finish? Ah, heavenly. This soup is comfort in a bowl. But did you seriously think you were getting any of it, Yates? Go back to your travel rations. Yates, fair enough. But no, that's not why I've come to speak with you. I've never asked for anything from you, Rainer. All I ask for now is a moment of your time. Rainer, ugh, there goes my appetite. Way to ruin a good thing. Yates, hear me out. I find myself faced with a crisis of sorts. I allowed myself to feel certainty about something without sufficient evidence. Until now, I have dismissed any claims of the existence of a soul as conjecture, superstition. But the spirit we encountered in the Alpine Woods cannot be explained otherwise, can it? Rainer, dot, dot, dot. Yates, are you familiar with the legend of the Pyre Stone? Rainer, of course, that cruel tale. I think about it every day of my life. The mythical stone that could supposedly bring back the dead. Thousands have thrown away their lives seeking it. But it's long lost, if it ever existed in the first place. What are you getting at, Yates? Pouring salt into my wounds? That's low, even for you. Yates, I too thought it but a tale. Indeed, all of my life's work has been to chase after what it represents. But now, I believe there is some truth to the tale. Rainer, just get away from me, would you? I've finally accepted what happened to Alicia. I don't want false hopes that will just be dashed to pieces. Yates, I'm not leaving until you listen to what I have to say. The Alpine Woods spirit was wearing a locket. There's not much power left in it, so temper your hopes. But, after studying it, I've come to the conclusion that the gem inside the locket is a shard of the Pyre Stone, or at least something akin to it. Rainer, you're serious, aren't you? Yates, I always am. That woman's longing for her beloved, combined with the stone's power, kept her spirit here after she died. Quite by accident, I would say. She likely had no idea the treasure she held. What a waste. But unlike her, I actually know what I'm doing. Her spirit might have been used up most of the residual power in the shard, but there are still vestiges remaining. I've focused this power for you. You should be able to call Alicia here, for a short while at least. Use your time well. Rainer, dot, dot, dot. Alicia, dare I hope? Rainer, dot, dot, dot. What? The smell of her hair. Is this a dream? 
Rainer now has access to the versatile special class, Spy Master. Give it a look in the troops menu. Rainer has unlocked the opportunist ability. While delving deeper into the mysteries of the ancient locket, Yates has learned to be even more effective with his powerful magics. Yates has learned the penumbral mastery passive. All right, so for the henge fragments, which is what you need to get into the the good ending for the game, uh, henge fragment one you get from a random drop for the bandit kawas. Hedge Fragment 2, which you, we saw you get from unlocking this, the Spy Master class. Um, Hedge Fragment 3, you actually get from the Jungle Temple. Uh, you complete Jungle Temple 2, complete Desert Temple 3, and then you come back to Jungle Temple to this story. So let's check out this story. Antoine, you're back! Kyrie, I believe you've had ample time to reflect on your actions. I'll open the seal for you. Don't get mixed up with the wrong crowd anymore. Yes, ma'am. Antoine, here. I had stashed these away, but now that I'm returning to farming, I don't think I'll need them. Received sapphire earring. Nice. Received obtained key item. Hench fragment three. And then hench fragment four. You complete the desert temple. Recruit Zaro. Go to the cavern trail and keep Somir alive. And then enter Gogomob City. I believe I kept him alive, so we're going to head over to Gogomob City. Elder, ah, Captain Kyrie and her friends. It is good to catch sight of you again. We have been looking into another way of dealing with the beast, so that no one needs to, so they can be disposed of for good. Kyrie, find anything interesting? Well, Elder, well, there might be another way. Rainer, what? Really? You might have mentioned that earlier when we, uh... Right, let's hear it. Hinge fragments you possess might just be the key. Area from which they came, Lodrastar Henge, is nexus of power where the Ma was summoned long ago. Portal there could be activated with fragments and then used to enter Ma's realm. But isn't the Maw here in Teora now? Why travel to its home realm? Elder, you would not go there immediately. But if you defeat Beast in battle and life energy returns to Beast realm, at that point you could use Portal to follow and dispatch for good. Rainer, simple. But what's the catch? Elder, catch was finding hench fragments. As fragments thought lost. Young Elder, and need one more thing. Elder, you need energy fragment from the Ma itself to connect the portal to Beast Realm. Kyrie, how would we go about getting that? Elder, we are not entirely certain. It must come from Beast itself, so you'll need to acquire it during fighting Beast. I already have one. Elder, Beast is defeated and you have energy fragment. Head for Lodestar Henge and activate portal. If all goes well, you'll be able to end the Ma's threat for good. And we would accompany you. We would accompany you, but I fear we're a little past our prime, and fighting was never a strong suit to begin with. Kyrie, we understand. Thank you very much for all your help and advice, elders. We will take care of the rest. Anodyne, so are we gonna seal the ancient beast away like before, or attempt to destroy it for good? Kyrie, defeating the mom will be our first step, regardless. We'll see how things play out from there. All right, everyone. We know what we must do. Let's get to it. So we have all four. All right. Off to Lowe's Star Henge. So we can place all of the thingamabobbers. Kyrie, we have all four Henge fragments now. Let's see what happens. Kyrie, this is the last one. Kyrie, someone appeared.
Kyrie, and he's not alone. Defeat all foes. Kyrie, Kyrie must survive. Begin. Ridge for the demonic of the mighty dark core. And that gives us a victory. Dragon's Nail. It's a pretty good dagger, actually. Kairu, now, can you tell me who you are and how you got here? Kairu. My name's Kairu, and honestly, I have no idea how I ended up here. Although I'm guessing this portal must have plucked me from Artania somehow, and deposited me here. Were you, by chance, just now fiddling with the portal? My experience is that portals tend to activate as a direct result of fiddling, or the proximity of mighty magical artifacts. <sighs> Kyrie, I was indeed trying to activate the device, although I had no idea it would bring you here, Kyrie. My apologies. I promise I'll do my best to return you to your home. Kairu, no worries. Truth be told, I'd hoped the portal would lead me somewhere interesting, and it seems to have done exactly that. I've been meaning to ask, what is this mark you bear? Kairu, you mean the mark? It's the sign of the marked, and enters me in a pilgrimage to become one of the immortals of the land. Why do you ask? Kairu, I've seen it's like before, back home. Say, could I accompany you on this pilgrimage? Kyrie, if you wish, my fiddling, as you call it, brought you here, so I feel responsible. But why do you wish to join us? Our journey will be quite dangerous. Kyrie, let's just say your mark is giving me an idea about what awaits at the end of the journey, and this time. In any event, I won't slow you down, I promise. I've been about similar business before. Kyrie, and what business is that? Kyrie, you know, saving the world, etc. <laughs> Kyrie, not quite the same thing as what we're doing, but you're welcome to join us nonetheless. Kyrie, excellent. Kyrie has joined your team. Achievement unlocked. The Okay, time for the last fight. One more time. And then on to fighting it in its no other area. Kyrie, this is much worse than anything I feared. I know last time, in our last video when we did this, this thing right here can drop the uh, thingy I need. If it, It's as if the Maw is transforming the land itself to match its home realm. And we're going to skip past this because we already went over it. And they talk about what we know what we need to do. We just need an energy fragment. He's going to handle the medallion. We're going to get to it. Defeat the Maw. Begin. All right, do we get the item? We got what we needed. We got the energy fragments. Good job, boys. Let's go ahead and finish this guy off. Eee. Of course, Anodyne is the MVP.
Kairi, well done, everyone. Now, we just have to follow it to its realm and deal the final blow. Let's head for Lode's Star Henge right away. Kairi, the portal is reacting to the energy fragment. Here goes nothing. Wow, this looks like the moon. Kyrie, we all made it? Rainer, all accounted for. Kyrie, so, this is the Maul's bolt hole. Primus, and our prison. Kyrie, that sounded like... Primus. Primus, yes, but I am lucid now. I see now that my arrogance gave the maw away into my mind. My old nemesis bested me, in the end. Kairi, but why are you here now? What are you? Primus, a remnant, I suppose. Whatever small part of me that the maw has not already consumed. I believe it is the fate of all immortals to end up here, after they pass, fueling the beast with our spirit, as it have fueled us with its energy and life. But now that you're here, please show me one small mercy, however undeserved. End our suffering. Do what I could not. Destroy the maw. Kyrie, that's what we're here to do. Primus, my thanks, and my apologies for what I'm about to do, as the Maw has control of us in here. Kyrie, I understand, Primus. Kyrie, everyone, let's finish the Maw once and for all, before it can recuperate and return to Teora. There won't be any more escape for you, beast. Defeat the Maw. Uh, I want... No. If anyone's going to be by themselves, it'll be Anodyne. Begin! Because she, she's the mightiest of the demons. Alright, she's going to come and beat on Primus, I think. There isn't one next there. Okay, there is one there. All right, Mirage. Actually, many masks. Okay. How much hit points do these things have? 900. He has got 1,500. All right, so they're each 999. Missed. Shackled soul. Ooh, nice crit. Let's get some barrier on us. And then she'll have two pets. Oh, that will heal it for a lot, but kills them slowly. Hopefully they don't heal themselves very well. Okay, it doesn't look like it. Oh boy. Ow, 
That was a lot. Very nice, but removed him from the board, so that was worth. Uh, they have resistances. Weak versus thunder. Weak versus water. Oh, shoot. I didn't even see that one there. Water bolt. Ow. The, ooh. Yeah, thankfully I had Mirage. Counter magic. That one can heal itself. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Hell yeah. And you can't cast anymore. All right, let's get that bleed, hopefully. Yeah. Dot effects are amazing. Oh, that's only going to get me there. Nice, very nice. We should be able to leap. was a hefty hit she took so now he does a little bit more damage here blood nova Ugh. ow I think that should kill two more. Or no, it didn't. Edge, ooh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, wreck yourself. Let's go ahead and get this one down. Very nice. Rainer can get the other one. Oh, no. Well, she just went down. <laughs> okay. Uh, they'll probably drop other homeboy. If they do the same thing, yeah, that's a lot of damage. It's fine. We got this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All of the status effects, buddy. All of them. They are for you. A gift. Woo! That hurt a lot.
<laughs> Very nice. Item full potion. Of course, he's got more abilities than everybody. Actually, didn't hit everybody. He's got six. Okay, we're going for it. Yeah. Yes. Good night, and thanks for all the great fish. Victory! They all got injuries. Poor guys. Kyrie, is it really over? Anodyne, Kyrie, your mark, it's gone. Kyrie, you're right. I can feel its power ebbing away. Rainer, it's really over then. Kyrie, let's go home. Achievement unlocked, breaking the seal. Fail seal. Arbiter's mark. So. A dozen centuries of immortal rule over. Rainer, a pretty good run all in all, I'd say. Quintus, too true, Captain Rayner. Anodyne, do you think you'll retire now, Quintus? Or uh, should I still be calling you Quintus, by the way? Quintus, ho, ho. I've been Quintus for so long, I think I can endure a few more years of my immortal title. <laughs> As for retirement, I do wish I could take a rest from all this. But it is not to be. Kyrie. Too much work to do, right? Tertia, as de facto interim ministers, Quintus and I must establish a new system of governance for the land before all hell breaks loose. Quintus, Primus was always the one who excelled at these things before the corruption took his mind. No use dwelling on that, though. Arbiters... Tertia is right about what is to come. I realize that you've done so much for the realm already, not to mention that an ex-immortal can hardly claim authority over you. But we can count on your aid during the chaotic times ahead. Oh my god. Anodyne, of course. But why all the doom and gloom? Didn't we restore order when we destroyed the Maw? Kyrie, we did for a time, but a new storm is on the horizon now. When word gets out the immortals have lost their powers, there will be all manner of scavengers looking to take advantage and wrest control. Rainer, from both within and without, we arbiters need to be ready. Zoro, how exciting! This means I'll get to bug you for even longer, Rainer. Aren't you glad? Rainer, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Rainer, it's an honor, Zoro. <laughs> gotcha I take it by your unbloodied blades that you didn't lend an ear to me friendly advice then Gary I won't tell you again gotcha keep those seditious thoughts to yourself the slightest spark can ignite a war right now Gotcha. Aye, aye, Captain. 
Yeah, nine. Um, I don't agree with Katja's friendly advice, Kyrie, but she does have a point buried in there. Are Quintus and, and Tertia really the best people to lead us right now? I know Quintus is a good person and all. He did vote against my mother's death sentence, but he won't be around much longer. And he did help set up the council and marked pilgrimage in the first place, which got us all in this, into this mess. And Tertia, she dodged my questions when I asked her how she voted. I'm not sure I can ever be at ease with her in charge. Katja. Old daughters who've had a knot but a demons tween their ears for too long. The lot of them. Kyrie, I do share some of your concern, Anodyne. Tertia's evasiveness is deeply unsettling. But she and Quintus are still our best option for keeping the peace at the moment. At the end of the day, that's what being in an arbiter is all about, isn't it? Yates. Hmm. Nothing has changed while I've been away. No fresh vandalism. Surprising. But nothing will be the same again. If I can isolate the restorative properties of the ancient beast essence. <laughs> yes. I can think of no nobler pursuit than extending life and health for those who are deserving. Immortals will monopolize that gift no more. So everybody, some people had their own agenda. Well, that was good to know. Okay, so there's, like I mentioned, there's actually one feature. It's actually only one thing that I didn't really use. So reset level. Um, this will reset the level of any character, right? You set them to level one, um, resets their stats to level one, but they keep all their class and AP, right? Um, and they, they kind of talk about it here. If you want to um, level them in specific classes, right? Um, it's not recommended. But, so, like, I would reset Anodyne to level 1 once I have all her classes set, right? Uh, the reason, and I'm going to go to my camp, is because classes, every level gives certain growth stats, right? So, if I want her to be ridiculously fast and have good attack, right, I can do a bunch of levels of Assassin. Or, like, her base class has a six attack, right, and a lot of health. Just make her super tanky, or not super tanky, but give her a big health pool and make her just hit super hard, right? It doesn't have a lot of speed, so you could do something like, you know, 30 or 40 levels of assassin, and then all of a sudden you swap to demon knight and then just cha-chunk her attack up, um, right? So it's one of those things, if you really want to min-max or you're playing on a harder set, setting to do something like that right or say you took way too many levels unlocking of a bunch of caster classes unlocking stuff and you feel like the character's too weak you can totally reset them and re-level them it's actually a pretty cool tool so that you don't have like a, a wasted character um i didn't do it at, at all and you can actually get both wins off the same save as well which is really cool so once you beat the last boss um it asks if you want to save afterwards and you save it. You can reload that game right before you fought the boss. Do all the other stuff, which is what I did with mine. And um, have both victories on the same game save. So you you don't have to com like make a separate save manually and do all this other stuff or completely redo the game uh, to get the other endings. You can get both endings off the same save, which is really cool. Um, definitely worth the money picking up this game. Definitely had a lot of fun with it. I say the campaign, if you don't restart or anything like that, is probably 20 to 30 hours, um, depending upon how much extra fighting and stuff you do. You could probably do it in 10 or less if you wanted to try and speed run it. Um, and you don't do any side stuff, which is actually po a possibility. Um, and supposedly it's quite challenging. I'm not sure. Uh, not my style. Um, I enjoyed kind of getting all the things and finding all the things. So. Um, but it's definitely an option. So, anyways, I would definitely recommend checking out this game. 
And, uh, you know, if you've watched all the way through, I do thank you for watching. Um, I definitely appreciate it. If you did, you know, leave a like, uh, comment, um, you know, consider subscribing and following me for other games. I do have other games that I'm working on. I have a Wrath of the Righteous and a Wasteland 3 campaign or campaign <laughs> um, gameplay going right now. And uh, I have some others on the docket. So, um, yeah, keep an eye out for those. And uh, stay safe, everybody. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video.